I'm Meki Grotus. I'm the director of the La Habra Life Center. We're excited to become a medical clinic because it will allow us to reach more women who might be looking for an abortion. We will be able to provide more health services to women in need. At this time, we are working hard to become a medical clinic. We have signed a lease for our new location and it is being renovated. This new building has an ultrasound room, more counseling rooms, a room devoted to material assistance, bigger bathroom and larger hallways. We have a registered nurse who is interested in being a sonographer, but she will need more training to be an ultrasound technician. We hope to find an additional ultrasound nurse and a medical director. We have the most caring volunteers, our first responders, but we realize we need many more. The areas I'm involved in are mostly administrative. I log in any donations that come into the center and I write thank you letters. Um, sometimes the donor will make a donation in, in honor of a relative and so we also acknowledge that. Saving lives, saving a gal from maybe making the wrong choice. We feel it's very important to write a thank you letter, not only to acknowledge how valuable that donor's um, donation is or their contribution, um, but also to keep them within our um, circle of keeping them informed about the latest events that are happening at the center, upcoming events, and our um, success at raising funds. We also do a, a baby bottle fund drive and we have a Mother's Day flower sale. So those funds keep us in business. A lot of times girls come in and they feel like they have absolutely no resources. They say that I can't have this baby because I can't afford a child and no one will help me. Letting them know how much their donation is appreciated and that it's helping mothers and their babies, and that the work that we do is, is so important in saving lives. Sharing stories with them, maybe about our, my life experience, and maybe what they're going through, and I try to make them feel like they're very loved by God. Giving them that support, helping them with clothing, food, uh, a crib, whatever it is that they need, that helps them to see that having a child isn't impossible. It's changing lives, saving babies, saving mothers from the worst situation they can come up with. They come in scared, but then when they find out what we can help them with, they walk away feeling empowered, feeling safe, feeling like the whole world is open to them. They can do anything because they can have this child. If they want to keep their child to, um, maybe if they can't, afford to have a child, we let them know that we are a life center and that we can help them with everything they need. We can refer them to other things if they need counseling, if they need other things. They're coming in for a pregnancy test and they're coming in to find out what to do about this baby, but they get so much more than that when they come in because all the counselors here give them life counseling. We say, okay, so if you, if you are pregnant, because we counsel them before they take the test, if you are pregnant, what are your plans? How are you gonna support this child? And, pretty, and they start out saying, I have no idea. I either haven't finished high school or I just got my diploma and I don't know what I'm gonna do. They walk away with answers as to what kind of career they want and how to achieve that career, how to continue their life. So having a baby is often the biggest motivation for these girls in why they're going to go to school and why they're going to make something of themselves. I would like to invite you to join our volunteer team. Would you like to schedule a tour of our new facility? Please call us at 562-691-9395. Thank you and God bless.